I'm in a church coffee bar. Just making some phone calls. In the last probably two or three weeks, I've had three different clients on the verge of hiring a very key person. And in all three cases, we've wound up talking about the same thing. It's that one thing, that little thing that just makes you uncertain whether this is the right person for the job. When you're talking about key positions, there's two things going on. There's what the person is going to be doing and how they're gonna do it. The what is rarely in question. If somebody's being considered for a job, it's pretty much guaranteed that they know what they're doing. That goes to competency. And if, if you're considering somebody for, for a certain managerial position or a certain technical position, Hopefully you've done your due diligence to know whether they're competent. They've, they've either proven themselves through a body of experience or they've passed some kind of certification or they've come with great references and they've demonstrated that they, they know what they're doing. But the second thing is much harder to judge and it's usually the sticking point. It's a big question mark because you don't know how they're going to do it. Are they going to do it the way you did it? Are they going to treat customers the way you treat customers? Are they going to lead people the same way you do? And that how goes more to cultural fit than anything. And it's one of the, the areas that I've seen these three business owners struggle with. Yes, the candidate is technically proficient. Yes, we're confident that they know what they're doing. But do we know how they're going to do it? Are we going to be comfortable with how they're going to do it? And there's they're big enough positions that they've taken a serious time out to consider, in some cases, for weeks on end, that very question. That's also one of the reasons that hiring from within is such a kind of preferable way to do things. If you've spent time working alongside somebody in the trenches and you've watched them go from job description to job description as they've moved through the organization, you've also seen how they have handled those responsibilities. And the what may change as they move around, but the how in terms of what's their what's their cultural fit with how you want things done, that never changes regardless of the job description. If you're in a situation where you're trying to hire somebody and there there is nobody within your ranks that's capable, you're gonna have to go looking outside your four walls to find somebody. And if you do, Personal references are often a lot more valuable than professional references. Personal letters of recommendation, personal introductions, people who can vouch for this person and tell you about their character are worth their weight in gold when it comes to determining whether they're going to be able to do the how the way you want them to. See you guys tomorrow. These are like beer mugs in a church. <laughs>